going on guys? Welcome to episode 11 of Full Day at the Shop. We weren't able to film on last Friday just because it was pouring rain. I didn't want Raul to drive over here. It was pretty slow too because we're in an outdoor mall. So any rainy days, um, kind of slow. Unfortunately, it wasn't too bad. It actually ended up not being too bad. We sold a good amount of pairs. We sold mummies that day and a couple other things. But um, yeah, ended up not being too bad selling wise. But there wasn't any buyouts, which is obviously what makes up the bulk of our videos. So I told Raul to come next week and here we are. Um, like I said, since he didn't come Friday, we got all of these weekends worth of buyouts and honestly it was one of our busiest weekends in terms of buyouts. We got so much stuff over the weekend, like multiple just whole collections. This right here on the counter is like a full size eight collection. It's a lot of heat, um, so we'll get into that. Um, starting it off with some SBs right here. Um, the Paras and the Polaroids. By the way, like I said, these are all size eight. So if you guys are interested in all of this, just DM us on Instagram. We can have it shipped to you for the people that are out of state. Um, and if you're not out of state, pick it up on the website. And just choose uh, in-store pickup and we can have these shipped to you. But a couple of SBs right here to start it off. Um, these are a size 10 and we have a nine and a half in these as well, the new Midnight Navies, which I'm actually pleasantly surprised on the quality on. It's actually not bad at all. Um, not my favorite colorway, but the quality on these is actually pretty solid. Some Jowns, you guys know I love these. These are actually our third pair, but this will be a used pair. Very clean though. Um, he even taped off the Jown on the inside, so this is a very clean pair. So these will go up for a good price. Um, some Amas, the ones and the threes, both DS, eight and a half, eight, great shoes. Um, all of these 2002 R's, the suede pack and the distressed ones right here. I think these are 175 each and then distressed I think were 200, maybe even a little thick, maybe like 185 actually. But yeah, all these 2002 R's, I like this model a lot as well. Some off-whites, forces, um, these are terrible, but <laughs> I don't know. I mean, maybe someone will buy them, they're cheap. I put them out like StockX Ask, so I guess we'll see if someone buys them. Um, then the lots, a fan favorite here at the store. Any of these lots are really good to have. Some Pata Air Max ones. Really, really nice shoe right here. Probably my favorite colorway for all the Padas, and I think this completes our set. I think we have all the Padas in store now. But I don't know if you guys can tell, it has like a lost and found like leather on them, like the cracked leather. It's actually a really nice little touch. Um, then some more random Yeezys and some playoffs. Um, we also got a ton of new stuff on the wall, so let's go check that out. And while we're up, let's get the fit check out of the way. Also, before Logan shows up and just outdoes me. Um, let's go ahead and get it out of the way. Uh, 80s Stussy hoodie. Really nice, like tan color. Love this hoodie. Stussy hat. Um, Stussy pants. Shout out Daniel. Oh, brother. I can't get up with those fucking pants. Dude, they're Jesus hard. Y'all tell Daniel that the parachute pants are hard. <laughs> Come on, I'm not crazy. And uh, the Jedi's for the first time. I'm rocking these today for the first time. I really like these. Do the khaki laces in them. Um, not a big fan of the neon ones, but uh, got the khaki laces in them. They're holding up well so far, just a little bit of sole sep, um, maybe like right here, but nothing we can't handle, just uh, gotta deal with it. It's an older SB, can't do much about it. Raul, show us on feet, man, please, please, man. Oh my goodness, Jesus Christ. Well, I don't need Logan out here, I don't need Logan here to outdo me, we got Raul wearing the cause fours. <laughs> Straight to toe, he just picked those up. What'd you pay for those, by the way? Uh, 13. 13, great price, man, that's pretty insane. So Raul pulled up with the heat. Everyone here is decked out. Our camera guy, all the employees, everyone's dripped out. So the dog. The dog, everyone's dripped out. <laughs> Astro with his Carhartt collar. <laughs> but everyone's dripped out. Crazy pair on feet for Raul. Um, but let's get into some new rivals over here. A dead stock pair of Ray Guns right here. Insane shoe. Just don't see these dead stock anymore, man. I think these are 2000. These are pink box. So yeah, 2005 on these as well. While we're on that real quick that pink box talk. Let me show you guys these uh, Shanghai's that we got. Grab up these. 2005 Shanghai SBs, really cool shoe. I would not mind these at all. I don't want them dead stock because I could not see myself undessing a pair like this, but they've come, they come with like little distressings on them, kind of like Nigel's. Like they have little scuffs on them, which is really cool. And they have these X's, like the stitching, the big stitching kind of reminds me of the Coraline. So really cool shoe right here. Definitely my vibe too, like these earthy colorway. I really like these. Um, so if anyone has 11 and a half or 12 used, DM us, I would not mind a pair of these. Another pair of the 2017 um, Motorsport alternates in the black colorway. We also got an older pair right here, 2015 Oreo 4s. I used to have these back in the day. I think Logan did too. Um, classics for us. And then also, there's another pair I wanted to talk about. Levi 4s. 
Got those over the weekend um, with a pair of used Travis One Highs. I want to show you all those already. I don't know what those look like, but I got a 10 and a half in these. And it's a lightly used pair and a lightly used pair of Travis One Highs as well. We got a long day ahead of us though, so hopefully it stays steady. Kurt should be coming in any second now to buy some uh, Storm Blues that I bought yesterday. So uh, stay tuned for that. These are bricks. These are bricks. These are bricks. These are bricks. Not everything has to be these a grill, man. This stuff moves. This is good stuff for this. Like these are gonna fly. Come on. These are bricks. Uh, tell them the story. On these those. are bricks. These are bricks. <laughs> we got these for five dollars each. Brand new vans. I told someone if someone buys one pair, we paid fifty dollars for five pairs. So if someone, oh, sorry, but we paid fifty dollars for ten pairs. So if someone comes in and buys one pair, it pays for all ten pairs, and then I'll give her the rest of them away. So that's what we're doing with those. So hopefully one pair gets sold, and then we'll give the rest of them away. Nobody cares. Fit check, man. Another uh, Nicole again fit. Little fall vibes. Uh, all the center swoosh. Uh, brown cargo pants and uh, the natural green. Uh, New Balance 550s. Hey, we really uh, dress it now, bro. Hey. Yeah. We really dress it now, my boy. Yup. Hey. <laughs> this hey, is when the fall season. This bro. is when the fits come out. So <laughs> get ready. Yup. <laughs> Got some older pairs here, right here. You don't definitely don't see these every day. Uh, the light Zen Gray 11s, dead stock. Pretty insane. Uh, 400 bucks isn't bad, honestly, too. Last sale on stock was 509, and then ask is like 500 still too. So, pretty good price here at the vault per usual. Um, dead stock with the face box, one of my favorite Jordan era boxes. Um, some really good pairs come in those boxes, but yeah, really cool. Something you don't see every day. The light Zen grays, and then also another pair you don't see right here. 09, right, Ro? Is that you said you had these back in the day? Yeah. yeah the too. raging bull pack with the black pair and the red pair. Really cool. Got that really dope box with the little bull sticking through the, the crate right here. Really cool pack. Um, these used to go for insane amounts. We've got these pretty well priced too, 550 for both. Obviously you get both shoes in the pack, so pretty dope. Nice little uh, vintage shoes, vintage, I guess. Well, I guess these are vintage. 2001, I consider yeah. that vintage. 2009, we're getting there. Maybe another there, five, yeah. seven years. Uh, but yeah, still some really cool pairs. Some pairs you can see over there. So Logan is now on the fence about these when he told me he would never, ever spend that much on a New Balance. Tell him no, no let him know, this is a good well, pair. I'm not spending that much on a New Balance. So do you like them or no? I never said I didn't like them. I just was looking, I was like, hmm. Wouldn't be a bad fit right about now, right? It's a good shoe, so, it's a good know. shoe. <laughs> I'm an idiot though, I'm so, an idiot. No, I always said that. <laughs> well, what'd you pay for them? My pair? Yeah. eBay, shout out to eBay. Gave me a $150 gift card, and then I bought them on release date for 400. So then I ended up getting for retail, 250. So 250? Okay. Yeah, because so, of the gift card. That's fine. I would have paid 450 any, for any, sure. Any more than that? I would have paid the I'm 450 good, fam. more, man. Like I'm good. For sure. So uh, let's get into this real quick, we'll though. Let's see. Uh, gift cards. If anybody wants a Vault DTX gift card for a friend or a loved one, um, shop all your sneaker needs. Yep. Vault DTX Vault. in South Lake, 1264 Main Street. And here's the website right here. Um, we buy, sell, and trade. As you can see, www.vaultdtx.com. But yeah, gift cards now available in store. Come grab your uh, gift card for the stocking stuff, for stocking stuffers for uh, holiday season. Yeah, we get asked a lot about these. Um, took me a few. Do you guys have gift cards and saying no and people walking out for me to finally get them? Um, I didn't really know how to go about doing it, but Shopify's system with it is actually really easy, so it was really quick to get them. Um, but yeah, a couple people came in the other day and I was like, do you guys have gift cards? And I was like, no. And just like, that's free money walking out the door. So it sucked um, to have to say no, but. We have them taken care of now. Hopefully those people are watching. I doubt it, but uh, if you guys are, we got gift cards now, so please come back and buy one. The Vault. What's up? Oh, hung up. <laughs> All right. <laughs> another day in paradise. Yeah, another day. <laughs> Hit must on the phone, man. The phone's brought us some good things, but it's also brought us a lot of bad. I wouldn't say that. We've gotten a lot of good buyouts over the phone, so. I don't know. Look at this guy. I don't know if I should, I don't know. <laughs> if I do it, if I do it, Matt's gonna Matt's gonna clown me. Matt's gonna, I'm, gonna give it, I'm giving it to Matt. I'm giving it to Matt's new shit. balance craze. I give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. <laughs> He's doing it. There they go. I'm glad you find this entertaining. No, I do. What's the trade? So what's the trade? So uh, I'm just gonna trade my sixes. Uh, sixes. I got them for retail. 
Travis, all sixes. I got both my sixes for retail. There you go. Yeah. And uh, I'm trading for those because uh, I'm a big six guy to be honest with you. But uh, you love you learn. You know? yeah. <laughs> Pleasure doing business with you, man. Pleasure. Always, always. always a pleasure. Nice. All, right. All right. So uh, our boy Victor's here, day one. Uh, how long have we known you, man? Since like what, seventh grade? Since fifth grade? Uh, no. Eighth grade? Seventh grade, eighth grade? Yeah. Eighth grade. Day one, man. Miss this guy, but uh, he's bringing us a pair of fire red fours. Um, <laughs> Jesus, that was really funny. <laughs> Some fire red fours right here in a size eight, and I've got his pair in the back. He also brought us a crew neck, um, which he might just take store credit on. He said, "Well, crew neck, well, cowboy's crew neck, pretty dope." Um, let me go get his pair. A pair of New, new Balances. Let me go grab the pair that Victor wants to trade for. These New Balance. 990 Moonbeams, Teddy Santis's. Really nice. He doesn't really like him, apparently. <laughs> he's just gonna rock him, though. He doesn't, he doesn't like him, he's just gonna rock him. Um, but uh, he's trading the Fire Reds for the Moonbeam New Balances. And uh, yeah, man, a little trade. See what he finds with the store credit on the crew neck. Hopefully, this guy's uh, pretty hard to work with, but yeah. <laughs> we'll see what we can do. <laughs> Got a new pair for the ceiling as well. Um, oh, I want to, maybe I might be wrong. Don't quote me on that. But 05 Olive uh, Fives, I think up there, pretty cool pair. Um, one of our boys that comes in and shops with us pretty frequently brought them to us, and I gave him some store credit for him. He actually is the one that gave us that MJ little banner too over there. The what's it called? Pennant, I think it's called. He gave us that for free. Um, shout out to him. He knows who he is. And uh, yeah, that's our one, two, three, four, five, six, seventh pair. No, eighth pair on the ceiling, so pretty cool, pretty cool pair. Um, the reason he gave them to us is because they were crumbling. He wore them once and they just cracked and fell apart. So pretty much same story that what happened with my uh, classic greens over there, um, happened with those. So he thought what better place to bring them than the vault. Everyone's really relaxed over here. So we got a new whip. I uh, thought we'd show the vlog, it's right here. Uh, just married. Congratulations, man. Hey, thanks, man. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you, I hey, appreciate it. It's a joke, it's right here. Here's the actual whip. A uh, little Defender 90. Astro's room in the back. Pretty dope. Pretty dope little car. Uh, we're getting a, I'm getting like a custom tire cover right here for like with the V for the vault. I think that'll be pretty cool. Um, so if you guys see me out in the wild, y'all know who I am, man. In, the, in this whip. Uh, uh, when we first got it, it was like red right here. We did just, we just did a little, a few things to it. Change the tires out, new rims, and uh, Put a black strip right here. It also made the roof black, tinted the windows. Everyone's always asking what I drive. Here it is. Here's the new whip. Everyone's always asking on TikTok, what does this guy drive? Here it is. It's what I drive. Yeah. Now y'all know. <laughs> Quick little trade we weren't able to get on camera. Um, he traded these four, I think added maybe 20 or 50 bucks for the Columbia fours that we posted the other day, the DS 2015 Columbia fours, or we'll pop a little picture up for the people that don't know. Um, it's kind of an older pair, so you don't see those too often. It was really cool to get those in, but he traded four pairs and added a little bit, just a little bit. Um, they're all used, but clean. The prototype ones, not my favorite. None of these pairs are my favorite, but still, lower end stuff honestly seems to move pretty well for us, just because it's a little bit cheaper. Um, pretty nice for a 12, the Chinese New Year 12s. Got like a satin material, with like pretty crazy inner liner. Um, the gold right here, nice little shoe. Cool box too. These go for actually a pretty decent amount. The uh, International Flight 12s as well. Again, a pretty nice 12. Got a really nice like suede and weird little pattern right there on the suede with some alligator skin. Pretty cool. Um, I, I could see these moving for, you know, we, we put these, normally when we get stuff like this, we put it for pretty low, like under 200 bucks. So I could see it moving for sure. And then a pair that we have actually sold a few times, the Denim 3s. Just a, you know, just a clean colorway Jordan 3 with the Nike Air on the back. People like these and they've sold pretty well for us in the past. So nice little trade. Um, got those Columbia's gone and we got four new pairs. I always love doing multiple pair trades for like a single pair just to, you know, get our inventory up. Um, even if the value is kind of the same, it's still nice to have four actual pairs than just one, especially on a pair like that. That's honestly going to be kind of a harder move. It's kind of one of those pairs that if you know, you know from 2015, it's not a super popular four. Still a nice pair, but not a pair that everyone's like out looking for. So it's cool to get a nice little trade for him. Um, yeah, not too mad about that. Kurt's here. Uh, we got a special delivery for him. We got a pair yesterday that didn't even hit the Instagram or anything. Um, just for our boy here. A uh, pair of Storm Blue Jordan ones. So he's about to 
I'm about to get his first reactions of these on camera. Stupid clean pair. They're clean, man. Woo. Yeah, they're very clean. Storm Blues. One of my favorites, man. It took me a while to get these. I just got them not too long ago, too. Maybe like a month ago. On the hookup at the vault, man. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> Let's go. Done. You want these? Yes, sir. Okay, so we agreed on 550 on those, right? 550. Okay, that's cool. <sighs> no, one, no one on the Air Maxes? I'll run a thousand for both. Where are they? I'll run a thousand for both. Just buy them now. Don't let me think about it. Just buy them now. <laughs> They're super clean. If, or if you want to wait to work out a trade with those bars here. That's I was going to say, let's work out a trade. That's I'll fine. bring the other ones in and we'll work out a trade yeah, with these. That's fine. We'll get and that then we'll swap those. Let's just get, grab these, wrap them up today. That's cool. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Just buy 50. Done and done. I appreciate it, man. Absolutely, man. You know, one of our best clients, man. You know what? Our best client. I'll oh, say look at that. I'll say it. <laughs> look at that. Truly, he's bought a lot of stuff from us. A lot of great stuff. This <sighs> the Benji's one, too. Yes, sir. Thank you, brother. Pleasure always. as always, man. Yes, sir. Appreciate it. Come check it out. Yes, sir. Astros always. <laughs> <laughs>
little different between summer. It just has a really nice back kit. It's got to be the shoes. And the back's probably really cool too. It's probably my favorite. It's pretty dope, man. Yeah, if these were, my, if these were our sizes, we probably would have kept them, but unfortunately, just a tad small. Um, other than that, oh, some new NASCAR tees. Shout out to Carson. Uh, sold some NASCAR. Some AOPs. Y'all love these. These always do well for us. A couple AOP uh, Dale Earnhardts, and there's also a really good one right here. What's up, Astro? Um, a really good one right here. The Dew Point T. Really crazy one. Front and back hit all over. Crazy T. Yeah, shout out to Carson for those. And yeah, those are pretty much it for the vintage new arrivals, I believe. So we've been getting a lot of comments, well, not a ton, but we've had a few comments here and there asking for a sneaker collection video of like both of our collections. Um, so we're considering doing that, but we'd like maybe some more yeses from you guys. So if you guys want to see that, let us know in the comments that you want to see a full sneaker collection video of me, of my collection and Logan's. Um, we'll get both of those in, we live together. So uh, we can show both of our collections in one video. Be pretty cool. Let us know if you guys want to see that in the comments. Please just comment and let us know, hey, we want to see the collection. Just let us know and we'll do it. We'll get that done for y'all. Let us know. Yup. All right, guys, that'll do it for episode 11. Me and Raul got a dip. Appreciate y'all for stopping by. See y'all next week for episode 12. And let us know if you guys want to see the sneaker collections. We can do that for you, too. Later, guys. Have a good one. Bye, boy. Watch the sunset. <laughs> <laughs>